Hey everyone, a little bit of uh, interesting news. So apparently, if you go to patreon.com slash Sargon, which is obviously Sargon of Akkad's uh, Patreon page for his YouTube channel, they kicked him off. He is gone. Uh, Sargon has been banned from Patreon, and nobody really knows why. Um, Patreon apparently has been trying to get rid of a lot of, quote, hate speech uh, creators, people who support or engage in hate speech, who use Patreon as a platform to gain monetary support. That's their words, not mine. Um, they've decided just to pull everyone, and apparently Sargon falls under the hate speech uh, category. But he's not the only one. James Alsup, another uh, well-known right-leaning YouTuber, also got his Patreon removed. Now I checked to see if uh, Medicare and Dick Masterson uh, have their Patreons removed as well. And no, they still have their pages up. But who knows? I mean, Alsup was just removed. People are getting banned left and right right now. So who knows what the case may be? Uh, obviously, you can see I'm recording at 11.23 p.m. Um, so things are subject to change. Who knows, by the time I upload this, you know, Medicare might be gone too. But um, yesterday, Milo Yiannopoulos was banned on Patreon in less than 24 hours. Um, so it seems just Patreon is just going through just mass banning everyone. And nobody really knows why. Apparently, they're trying to cleanse the platform, I guess. But, you know, it's like people like Sargon. You know, I know a lot of people don't like Sargon. But he's not really done anything that's like warranted, you know... The removal of his Patreon, at least in my opinion, he wasn't running any scams. He wasn't, you know, obviously he's done some questionable things, especially if you follow uh, Ralph and his crew. You know, you probably aren't a big fan of Sargon if that's the case. But he's obviously done nothing to, you know, he's he's not he doesn't he didn't deserve this at all. Um, you know, he made a pretty penny on Patreon, and he used that money to you know support his family. So his main source of livelihood is gone now. And I'm sure he'll be able to set up something on, like, a competitor side to Patreon. But he's not going to get the same amount of money he was making before. You know, not everyone's going to move over. So they just completely wiped his main source of living. And that's, you know, that's obviously, like, say what you will about Sargon, but he did not deserve this one bit. I mean, like I said, unless he was running a scam on here, but, you know, nobody really, um... You know, no, nobody really knows that, uh, and it's highly unlikely that that's the case. So, Sargon got pulled, James Alsop got pulled, a lot of well-known right-leaning people are getting pulled off. Uh, some are still left, like I said, Medicare, Dick, Dick Masterson. Uh, but who knows how long they'll last on here. This is absolutely insane. So, um, if, you, if, you, if you think you, you know, you know what's going on here, be sure to leave it in, in the comments. I'm just kind of kind of baffled right now because you know obviously you know we know platforms like twitch aren't entirely the most friendly with you know people like these people or you know twitter starting to buckle down but patreon's never really had an issue with these people up until now so it seems like they're just doing a complete 180 all of a sudden uh, but then again i'm not too terribly familiar with the platform i haven't started my own patreon yet so maybe this is maybe this is a uh, writing on the wall either way i don't know what's going on but uh, it sucks to see these people go. No one really deserved this. People deserve their livelihoods, whether they're on the left or the right. Uh, SGWs and everyone, even you know people I don't like, unless they're doing anything illegal or they're scamming the platform, they deserve to make a living off of Patreon. So sucks to see them go. But yeah, this is my update.